Welcome to Fabulous Lake Tahoe, your local's guide to the very best of America's year-round playground. I'm Jack Durst, and this is your concert report for March 2012. March 2012, we have a lot of great events coming up on our concert report for March. Um, I want to like, let you guys know that I have a new video out. I have a video on how to take better pictures with your camera phone in 15 minutes on a walk through the park in Lake Tahoe. I explain everything you need to know to take better pictures with your camera phone, and it's all about paying attention to the photography and not paying so much attention to the technology of how you're taking the photographs. I really want to encourage you guys to click on the annotation and see my video of how to take better pictures with your camera phone because that's why my concert report is late this month. I missed a couple of really good concerts and I apologize for it. I missed George Thorogood at Harris South Shore Room. I had several friends who went to the George Thorogood show and by all accounts George Thorogood totally rocked at it. So I'm sorry I didn't get to report on it, but that's kind of the way things go. We have a lot of great events coming up here in March. As always, this is an interactive video. So go to fabulouslaketahoe.blogspot.com or click the QR code on your screen to access the playlist that goes along with this video where you can see all of the bands that are playing Tahoe in the month of March 2011. March 1st through 4th, Graham Elwood and David Feldman will be playing at the Improv at Harvey's at Harvey's uh, Casino in South Shore. March 2nd through 11th will be the North Tahoe Snow Vest, including a Polar Bear Swim March 2nd, Hometown Parade March 3rd, Fireworks March 2nd, the Lake Valley Firefighters Ball at the Mont Blue March 2nd, March 3rd and 4th, the Ralph's Bonsai Ski Tournament is going to be playing at the um, Squaw Valley Ski Resort. Ralph's Bonsai is a huge ski tournament for freestyle skiing, every kind of freestyle skiing you can imagine. All the big celebrities are there right now. It is the fourth when I'm filming this. Um, also March 4th, there's a polar bear plunge at the North Shore at Commons Beach on the North Shore. Check out the video of the polar bear plunge. Um, also March 4th, Rose's Pawn Shop will be playing with Bandit Lons and Lonesome Locomotive at the American Legion Hall. March 6th is one of the biggest concerts that Tahoe has had in a while. Reggae rock heavy metal rap band 311, who are totally undefinable, one of the great bands of my childhood, will be playing at the Mont Blue with Act the Dirty Heads. You should check out the video of the Dirty Heads if you don't know who they are. They are an awesome band. They are every bit as worth, worth as much seeing as 311 is, in my opinion. Also March 6th, We Rage, K-Theory, Gerbtron, and J-Mouth will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club on the North Shore. March 7th through 11th, Greg Fitzsimmons and Dana Eagle will be playing at the Improv at Harvey's. Also March 7th, Tony D'Andrea with Mark G and Miles Weber will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. Um, March, March 9th through 11th, the Tahoe Youth Ballet, Every Little Girl Dreams of Being a Ballerina. Well, you can come see our, little girl, our local little girls be ballerinas at the Tahoe Youth Ballet. They're going to be doing the original ballet, Into the Woods. They're also going to be doing a set selection from the ballet Giselle. It, they'll be at the Calneva on the North Shore. March 9th is the Wild and Scenic Film Festival at the Mont Blue Casino Resort. The Wild and Scenic Film Festival is one of these great outdoor film festivals we have here in Tahoe. It's several different outdoor films, clips from outdoor films. It's very much like the Tahoe Mountain Film Festival, except it happens a little later in the year when the spring break crowd is here. They have some great, vi they have some great videos on display. Um, also March 9th, Tony Furtado and Brothers Comatose will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club on the North Shore. Environment and Angerhead will be playing at Rojo's on March 9th. The Dead Winter Carpenters featuring Dad's LPs will be playing at the American Legion Hall in South Lake Tahoe. Also the 9th, there will be a St. Baldrick's Head Shaving for Cancer at the Tahoe Ice Rink. And at the Harris um, Convention Center, there will be the annual Kiwanis Club Crab Feed that night. Very busy night. March 10th, Paul Revere and the Raiders will be playing at the Harris South Shore Room behind me. Also March 10th, Billy Gardrell of Mike and Molly will be playing at the Mont Blue. He's a very, very funny comic. Check out his video in the playlist if you haven't seen him. Um, also check out Kaiser Soze. Kaiser Soze is a local legend. They're from Reno, but they play all over the area. They're going to be playing at 7800 that night at Kirkwood. Um, they play kind of ska and funk music. They are really, really good. Also March 10th, Papa Gross Funk and Vinyl featuring Daryl Hance from Mofro will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club on the North Shore. March 11th, another one of these huge March concerts, Sublime with Rome 
will be playing at the Mont Blue Auditorium, and their special guest is almost worth the ticket price in and of himself, Everlast. Rapper Everlast will be coming as the featured artist for Sublime with Rome on March 11th at the Mont Blue Resort behind me. Also March 11th, there will be a Tahoe Cross Country Gourmet Ski Event at the Tahoe Donner Downhill. Um, there will be Umphreys McGee featuring Howlin' Rain at the Crystal Bay Club March 11th. March 12th, Delhi to Dublin will be coming to Moe's Place. March 13th, Bass Cadet and Micah J will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. Also March 13th, Party Marty featuring Smashletooth the Tiger will be playing at the Lakeside at Night in Kings Beach. March 15th is a very special day. It's the Hard Rock Cafe Annual Battle of the Bands at Harvey's Lake Tahoe. Hard Rock Cafe is on the casino floor at Harvey's. They're going to be having 12 local bands doing a battle of the bands, and you, the audience, get to decide who the best band of the night is, who takes home the prize. Also March 15th, during the daytime, there will be a gong bath offered at the Tahoe Wellness Center. I believe you need a Prop 215 card to go to the gong bath, but Relaxation Soundscapes has an amazing gong bath experience. Check out my Wanderlust video for more information on gong baths. They are really cool. March 16th is the Kirkwood Freeride Flow Festival. Go to www.freerideflowfest.com for more information on the Kirkwood Fr Freeride Flow Festival. It's a very Wanderlust-like event where they have yoga, backcountry skiing, and music all together in one big event. And it is going to be awesome. There's going to be music. The music is going to feature Justin, Mar Justin Martin and Michael Menmert. Um, also, also the 16th through 18th, Beatles tribute band Rain, who I have seen in person in a show, they are awesome, are going to be playing at the Pioneer Center in Reno. I mean, I know Reno's a bit of a drive from Tahoe, but Rain is well worth going to Reno to see. Also March 16th, Afrofunk Experience will be playing with Mojo Green at the Crystal Bay Club, and Vocab Company with, su with Subreactor will be playing at Whiskey Dick Saloon on March 16th. March 16th is the Tahoe St. Patrick's Day Parade, never mind that it's not actually St. Patrick's Day on the 16th, with an after party from 6 to 10 p.m. March 17th is St. Patrick's Day proper. There are lots and lots of different events going on on St. Patrick's Day. I urge you to take a look at any of our local, our great local Irish pubs. Murphy's Irish Pub is going to have a live band on St. Patrick's Day. McPee's also is going to have live entertainment on St. Patrick's Day. There's an official Lions Club corned beef and cabbage St. Patrick's Day event at on the North Shore at the Truckee Community Arts Center. Also March 17th, Drive-By Truckers, another band I'm very fond of, is going to be playing at the Harris South Shore Room. Drive-By Truckers is kind of this resurrection of the old 70s Southern rock. Their first album was all about the guy from Leonard Skinner and how he supposedly sold his soul to the devil for a record contract. They have been doing amu amazing music for a decade now. You should definitely check out their video. Also, March 17th, Hot Buttered Rum will be playing with Cornmeal with After Party with the Congress at Crystal Bay Club. Also, the 17th, the Vampirates, the Firebombing, and Kill the President will be playing at the Whiskey Dick Saloon. Kill the President is a all-star band featuring members of the Hoods and the Decepticons. Um, Groovebox will be playing at 7800 at Kirkwood on March 17th. March 18th, the Danger Bees will be playing at 7800 feet at Kirkwood. Um, March 19th, Capadonna from Wu-Tang Clan will be playing at Moe's Place in South Lake Tahoe. March 20th, Matt the Alien with Trevor Kelly will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. George Clinton and Parliament Funkadelic will be playing March 22nd live at the Mont Blue. They're I can't say enough about George Clinton. George Clinton is the root of all modern sampled music. There would be no modern rap without George Clinton. There would be no dubstep music without George Clinton. He was the per person who pioneered allowing his music to be sampled. So George Clinton is a great option of some something very hip to do March 22nd. March 23rd, Acorn Project will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. March 24th, there will be the High Up Fest at Kirkwood Mountain Resort. Um, High Up Fest is a huge reggae music festival. They have reggae, they have modern music. They're going to be featuring Iration, who play Tahoe a lot. Um, they, were, they just got back from their tour with Slightly Stupid, and they're really, really high key right now. Uh, check out the annotation for a video of Iration. Also playing at the High Up Festival, Collie Buds, New Kingston, The Movement, 
Zion One and Kelly James, all at 7800 at Kirkwood. And there will be an after party with Weapon, DJ Chronic, and DJ Odyssey at 7800 after the High Up Fest is finished. Go to www.highupfest2012.com for more information about the Kirkwood High Up Festival. Also that night, Rock Sugar will be playing at the Harris South Shore Room. Rob Schneider will be playing March 24th at the Mont Blue. You might know Rob Schneider from his comedy routines. Also, March 24th, Murderlicious, Falling to Pieces, and Cursed will be playing a rock show at Whiskey Dick Saloon, and Flex Bronco will be playing at Rojo's Tavern in South Lake Tahoe. There will be a Duran Duran tribute band at the Crystal Bay Club March 24th. Man, you get really good bands during spring break at Tahoe. This is, it's worth coming to Tahoe for spring break just for the music on the weekend, really. March 25th, Melvin Seals and the Jerry Garcia Band will be playing at Moe's Place. Also March 25th, Galactic with Corey Glover and Corey Henry will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. Um, Galactic is kind of hard to explain. They're kind of an electronica band. They have some rap layers in their things. They have a lot of guest artists. Uh, you should check out their video in the playlist for more information. March 26th, Conspirator with Mark Brownstein and Aaron Manger will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. March 30th, the Tahoe Business Expo will be coming to the Harris Convention Center. You can come out and meet all of South Lake Tahoe's great businesses at the Harris Convention Center. If you're a local business owner, you should go to tahobusinessexpo.com for more information about getting a booth at the Tahoe Business Expo. Um, also March 30th, there is a green attire dance at the Senior Center if you missed out on the real St. Patrick's Day celebrations. And there will be a local show showcase at the Crystal Bay Club featuring Tim Snyder Sound Society and Jelly Bread. March 31st, 80s band Blue Oyster Cult will be playing at the Harris South Shore Room. Head for the Hills will be playing at the Crystal Bay Club. There will be a Good Neighbor Donation Day where you can bring your old gear to Heavenly Village. And Scarab will be playing at 7800 at Kirkwood. Now, there's a lot of things that go on all month, every month in Lake Tahoe. And I'm just going to give you a quick calendar of them here. Mondays, there's DJ Sonar at Rojo's. Tuesdays, there's a Mindful Massive dub Dubstep DJ at Whiskey Dick Saloon. It's karaoke Night Tuesdays at Rojo's. Wednesdays, there's a Dirty Dubstep DJ every Wednesday at the Opal Night Clu Club at the Mont Blue. Thursdays is the Shred Night Apri Ski Party at the Airport Lounge at the Flight Deck at the Tahoe Airport. Th also Thursday, Dubstep DJ Billy Wonka and Friends at Whiskey Dick Saloon. Thursdays is also Tony's Open Mic Night, which is our best open mic night at town at the American Legion Hall. Fridays and Saturdays, there's karaoke at the Horizon Aspen Bar. Fridays, there's also karaoke at the Lakeside Inn. Also, every Friday, there's an Apri Ski Party at Vex. There's open mic at 7800 on Fridays. Also, Saturdays, there is live jazz at the Tahoe Biltmore. Thursday through Monday, there is improv at Harvey's. Just because I don't list who the comics are, there is always a comic Thursday through Monday at improv at Harvey's, and he's always funny, or she's always funny. Also Thursday through Monday, there is Illusion Fusion Magic Show at the Horizons Golden Cabaret. You can come see Alex Ramon do an amazing ma magic show. I just want to quickly remind you guys that there are sale, sale tickets on right now for the Harvey Summer Concert Series. The tickets for Chicken Foot are going to go especially fast. They opened this Friday, and there's already huge demand for Chicken Foot tickets. So, if you want to see Chicken Foot, you should call the, the Harris Harvey's box office right now, because those tickets are going to go fast, even at $75 a head. All my Google Plus friends are complaining about how expensive it is, but it would sell out overnight if it wasn't that expensive, folks. I want to urge all you guys to check to click on the annotation and check out my video about how to take better pictures with your camera phone. In just 15 minutes, I can teach you everything you need to know about taking better pictures with your camera phone, and it doesn't hurt, I promise. I want you to subscribe to Fabulous Lake Tahoe if you haven't already. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. Thank you, and keep Tahoe blue. Bye.